Hello, Aquarius. It's my lady from my lady's lady tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly weekly love reading for the week of March 22nd. Um let me make sure because I don't know everything is wrong over here. 22nd to the 29th. All right, March 22nd to the 29th. I definitely wrote the wrong numbers now. Uh, the cards I'm using today are Dreams of Gaia Tarot. And these are by Raven Phelan. I haven't used these in a long time because I'm not extremely familiar with um, the little symbols and stuff I have. On here but I'm gonna do my best you guys um but I'm closing off with my fin de sesu kipper cards by Kiro Marchetti okay we're just gonna switch it up a little bit today and Sasha is in here so uh, if you hear some crazy noise in the back it's probably her and then it's half I got the window open outside it's a beautiful day so you're gonna be hearing some birds some cars and probably some loud music and probably planes all kinds of stuff all right so yeah that was Sasha Let's keep going. All right. Let's get this show on the road. All right. What's wrong? What's going on with the Aquarius? So I don't know what just happened, y'all, but all of a sudden, maybe it's because of me talking so much, but my jaw start hurting, okay? So be careful, okay, like about stepping on needles. Keep your needles, nails. Um, I feel like whatever, I feel, I don't know, I heard locked jaw. So just make sure you're not stepping on nothing weird. Or stay away from like rusty metals and stuff. Um, and this could come from chewing a lot. Maybe chewing a lot of gum or something. Maybe stress somebody grinding their teeth. Okay, that's the kind of feeling that I'm having right now. Let's keep going. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, what's going on with the Aquarius? I'm feeling Capricorn energy too, okay? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Aquarius, Aquarius. So let's see what's in here. Okay, so we got the desire card here. So I do feel like somebody's wanting something, someone. Um, I feel like maybe someone or something to happen. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. All right, so we got the chrome card reverse. Okay, so let's look at this card. So I don't know. When I see this card, I feel like somebody is... I do feel like somebody is trying like some kind of magic stuff, okay? I feel like somebody is trying to like manipulate a situation, okay? I do feel like somebody could be a little bit not so happy because their plan is not working with this chrome card being reversed. And I don't know if y'all can see the fire, but my stage is going crazy right now. I just hope it go out. All right, let's keep going. Going on with the Aquarius. Oh, this fire is live all right so we have the ten of i think this is the ten of wands here yes this is the ten of wands reverse so i do feel like somebody is dealing with someone i do feel like this person that you're dealing with they're very hmm i feel like they're very emotionally draining i do feel like they want to take things from you I feel like they want to take anything from you. Credit, like, I do feel like if you do something good, they don't want you to feel like that's good. Um, just anything you would like or is good for somebody to have, I feel like this is being presented, but I do feel like it's being, like, disregarded, okay? Oh, this fire getting a little too crazy, y'all. I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to blow it out. Sorry. All right, let's keep going. Yeah, but somebody's getting sick of someone who is very um controlling. I do feel like somebody is like manipulative, okay? Energy vampire, big time. Sneaky, conniving. Okay. All right, so we got the wisdom card reversed here. So I do feel like somebody's regretting this decision to deal with this person. Okay, I do feel like 
somebody is regretting getting into this situation. And I also feel like they're going to regret leaving it, okay? Because I do feel like even though you're leaving this person, it seems like they're going to still try to make things hard for you, okay? Hard for you, harder for you, okay? Nothing's going to be easy. All right, so we got the integrity card here. So I do feel like, of course, once you tell this person you're done, um, tell this person how you feel, what you need, what you want, what you will, what you want to accept. I do feel like that's when this person is going to start all this sneaky business, okay? So we got the queen of, of water here. So I do feel like somebody is extremely emotional about everything that is going on, okay? Mm-hmm. Heart definitely on the sleeve. I do feel like somebody wants to care. But with this Ten of Wands reverse, I feel like somebody just does not have the energy to do it anymore. I just can't do it anymore. It's like I try to give, I try to love, but when I turn around, you just try to break me down. You know, you never want anything good for me, but I'm always trying to get good for you, be good for you. All right. So I'm pretty sure this is the Ace of Pentacles here. So I do feel like somebody may be getting ready to... Oh, is this the Ace of Pentacles? Hmm. I believe it's the Ace of Pentacles. I mean, it looked like green. All right, so we got the Ace of Pentacles here. So I do feel like um, somebody's getting ready to do some kind of changing, okay? Maybe more money, maybe a new job, maybe um, this fire. I didn't let this go too crazy. All right, new job, new property. Um, I do feel like some, once somebody leaves this situation, I do feel like there's a lot of money and a lot of stability coming in, okay? So this could be somebody who's just going to be trying to focus more on money and work once this person is gone. Um, but it could be like somebody got to sell assets. And when you sell these assets, um, I do feel like, of course, money is going to come back, okay? All right. So we got the mother car here. Oh, goodness. All right. So I do feel like um, there, in some cases, there may be a pregnancy. Um, but I also feel like hmm, I feel like somebody is, is there to protect you. Okay. I feel like somebody is there to protect you, to be there for you. Okay. You could be the mother trying to be there for a family member, friend, child, anything. Okay. You could be the protector of someone else. Okay. But I do feel like in this journey, while someone is moving from one place to another, I do feel like they're going to be protected. Okay. Mm -hmm. Protected by people here. All right, let me flip this upside down so I can read it correctly. Um, so I believe this is the nine of pentacles here, okay? But it's reversed. So I do feel like even though somebody is getting ready to get some kind of property, some kind of more money, more job, I do feel like they're going to have to spend a lot to get here. And it's crazy because that's the energy that I was feeling. Of course, you're going to have to sell something, um, to get away from it. Okay. Cause I feel like somebody don't want whatever this is. Um, so I do feel like somebody is going to be selling that, but then they got to buy something, you know? Yeah. Just like you, you unless you're just going to go without somewhere to live. Okay. So unless you're going to buy it, you got to buy a new car if you sell the old one. Well, you don't have to, but you know what I'm saying? All right. So we got the Ace of Water reverse here. Let me make sure this is the Ace of Water. Yes, this is the Ace of Water. So I do feel like somebody lost care, lost love, lost passion, um, just lost the emotion to be in this situation anymore. And I do feel like it's just because somebody was always playing games. It's like I'm feeling a situation where um, I come home and I, did, I had a raise. And, you know, I'm feeling great. And I tell my partner this and they turn around and say, oh, is that it? Oh, well, that's not, and, and until you start feeling bad, they not feeling good about it. So it's like, nobody can control your energy except them. Okay. They don't want your job. They don't want you. They don't want your friends or your family, anybody that loves you to have any control over your feelings. They want to take that away from you and give it back to you. Okay. So it's just like, somebody is just done with this emotional 
crap. Okay, the, these emotional games this person is playing, trying to play with somebody's feelings and emotions, okay? So let's see what's going on with these Vendessesu Kipper cards, okay? Mm-hmm. Okay, well, we're going to let that one stay out. I usually don't. I don't know. That scared the heck out of me, too, because I wasn't expecting that. It was just like... <laughs> All right, I'm going to cut the rest of these, though. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. All right. So with the other thoughts, so it's like, yeah, this person does not want you to form your own thoughts, your own opinions. Mm. This person wants to be the center of attention. This person wants to be your, your, your everything. Okay. Mm-mm. Nope. All right, let's see what this is. All right, so we got the sudden wealth. Yes, that's definitely what I was just talking about. Sudden wealth, somebody just got a bonus. Somebody got a raise. Somebody is getting something, okay? Sorry I ruined this card, but ain't no jigglies on here, okay? Not on this channel. But, yes, yeah, somebody got a new job, some kind of unexpected money. Um, I do feel like somebody else feeling good about themselves or what's going on. This main male or masculine energy, they wants to take that away from you. They don't want you to feel like you have the power that you have and you can do those things. So they take it away from you and give it back to you like it was theirs to give, like you didn't earn it yourself, okay? And that's the type of person that this is. And I do feel like instead of getting sick of everything else, which is what usually happen, happens, you're getting sick of them, okay? I'm getting sick of yo, but not them. All right, so of course. So I got the wealthy man reversed here. So I do feel like this person, like, oh, goodness, if this person know they're doing good, you know, and this person gets in this position, um, I do feel like this person may be trying to push somebody away from doing this as well, okay? But if this person get in this position or, or get in this mind, uh, mind thought process, they'll know that I'm not good enough for them. And they'll possibly leave me. So let me just bring them back down to my level so they won't leave me for somebody better, okay? So that's the main energy that is coming from these cards. And that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.